Commander, Dr. Chuck was sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the medbay. You always pull through, Commander. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medigel delivery systems. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Cliff. Excellent find, Commander. The information network terminal has been updated. Thanks for coming by. Trainer, can you send Diana up? She wanted an interview. Right away, Commander. Ready for a chat, Commander? I'm ready. Commander, it's no secret that Council Space has suffered some serious losses to the Reapers lately. Now Cerberus has struck directly at the seat of our government. If something as small as a human terrorist organization can hit the Citadel, is anywhere safe? Cerberus has limited resources. This coup attempt was likely the best they could do, and it cost them a lot of money and troops. A little fear is understandable, but it can't paralyze you. They've failed as many times as they've succeeded. But humanity has lost its counselor. The Alliance Parliament is destroyed, and the Prime Minister's dead. The line of succession is getting pretty short. How long do you expect any new Alliance administration to last? Leaders will rise. You can't lose hope. Our enemies won't rest until they've taken the last human being. Until then, we're not beaten. Right now, it's everyone's duty to step up. All right. Now, a question from Thessia. Commander, during your tribunal, some said you had Cerberus ties. Thanks for your time, Commander. This is Diana Allers for Battlespace. Good night, and stay strong. Be careful, Commander. You keep feeding me like this, and I'll follow you home. Looks like you already have. What happens now? You gave me a good interview, Commander. That's all I need. Tonight. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built from that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy, though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. I like the feel of something solid in my hands. Well, now that I know your weakness, we might have to try a game. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. You sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun we're having.
jump successful.
dig up any information on the mission, Liara? I did, and I now understand why High Command wanted to hide it. We're headed to an Ardat Yakshi monastery. Ardat Yakshi? Like Morinth? Morinth chose to be a killer. These Ardat Yakshi isolated themselves to avoid that. But it doesn't mean they're harmless. Their urge to feed can be powerful. That's why High Command sent in commandos to investigate the monastery's distress signal. What were the commandos for us? If there was a chance the Ardat Yakshi could break loose, the commandos were to purge the monastery. Purge? You mean destroy? They would have brought heavy explosives with them, yes. Morinth was dangerous, but are the Ardat Yakshi this big of a threat? Morinth was just hitting her stride. Ardat Yakshi who kill leave behind astronomical body counts. It's why they can never be free, and why they're such a great source of shame to the Asari. That's why High Command won't rest until this place is destroyed. They'd never risk a single Ardat Yakshi getting loose. Don't assume anything. Maybe the Ardat Yakshi sent out the distress call. If the Asari want us to destroy this place, I need to know what happened. Agreed. Once we give a report to High Command, they'll stop wasting lives here. Elevator disabled. To prevent entry or escape, I wonder. Hear something. Stay sharp. It would seem the Asari commandos felt silent because the Reapers were here to greet them. This monastery's out of the way. What do the Reapers want with Ardat Yakshi? Anything useful? A floor plan, marked with the nav point location of a bomb. It's in some place called the Great Hall. The commandos decided to purge this place. Ardat Yakshi or not, evacuating this place would have saved a lot of lives. If there's no survivors, let's get to the Great Hall and set off that bomb. was my fault, sorry.
Very good. I almost didn't hear you. Samara? It has been some time, Shepard. You are a most welcome sight. The corruption here runs deep. I assume you're here on your own, Justicar. Perhaps for something special? You are correct. Two of my daughters live here, and I have come for them. Unfortunately, the Reapers had already invested this place by the time I arrived. You met me hunting down your other Ardat Yakshi daughter. Are these ones just as dangerous? Valer and Rila have followed the Monastery's rules ever since they arrived. They've shown no inclination toward violence. And you're here to save them? They are my responsibility. And it's one that cannot be abandoned, even as our galaxy crumbles. Let's go together. Maybe your daughters can tell us why the Reapers hit this place. I suspect they will have much to tell us. It has been centuries since I last saw them. We're out of time. We'll meet again. I will draw these creatures off. Wait! Let's go. Isolated fortress. The Adat Yokshi must have believed they were safe from the war. If they knew about it at all. They learned. Yes, Commander. A new enemy! The Reaper's done. Soon as I was able. Shepard, this is Faler, my youngest. She and her sister Rila are Ardat Yakshi. 
They have Arthur, Rila. They have Rila. What? I saw some of those creatures take her into the Great Hall. I've been trying to get there. What are the Reapers doing here? Harvesting us. They're turning us into... Into those... Monsters. Please. You can't let that happen to Rila. The Asari thought the Ardat Yakshi were to blame for the attack. This is our home. Most of us are grateful to be here. The monastery is a place Ardat Yakshi can achieve peace. Valer speaks truthfully, Shepard. I vouch for her words with pride. Then we have to find Rila fast. The Great Hall has a bomb in it. A bomb? But didn't you come to rescue people? We'll try, but we can't leave this place standing, Falaire. You sound like the Commandos. They didn't stop to help anyone. Falaire? I'm sorry. Falaire! The Great Hall. She's looking for Rila. We'll meet you there. Please be swift. You'd need a crowbar to pry those doors open. This place was beautiful before the Reapers came. Jethro, this is Galay. I've blocked extranet access. We don't need the students panicking about these Reaper rumors. Still, it will not hurt to tally our supplies. Please bring me an inventory before evening prayer. I'll contact Cessia later tonight to inquire what sent the Asari to war.
another dead commando. The Asari should have rid themselves of the adult Yokshi. By rid themselves, you mean kill. My people would never let such monsters walk among them. They didn't care for the competition? Bleh. to turn her into one of the Reaper's creatures. I'm sorry. Can we set off that bomb? We need a detonator. Commandos would have had one. We've got to find it. Get back to that bomb. Filaire, go! Take the elevator! Rila, what, what are you doing? It's too late for me. There are hundreds coming. Just go!
Gabriela. There wasn't even time to say goodbye. Few can break the Reaper's hold. Rila's will was extraordinary, as was her love for you. We left her to die. Rila made her choice, and it has reminded me of what is truly important. Why I swore I'd lay down my life. What is that? Thalair? The code demands an Ardat Yakshi cannot live outside a monastery that no longer exists. What are you doing? I'm sorry, Shepard. By the Justicar's code, there is only one way to save Valer. Mother, no! My daughters, you were all so much stronger. Let go. What are you doing? Fulfilling the code. By throwing your life away? I won't kill my last daughter. You won't have to. Valer? I'll stay here. Home. No matter what's become of it. Without a proper monastery, I could have left any time. I don't need a building to honor my own code. And if the Reapers return? They won't take me alive, I promise. Then, the code permits you to stay, as you are. Once this war is over, and if I am able, I will visit, as a Justicar should. I'd understand if you wanted to help Valer rebuild a home here. It must wait now that I can help oppose the Reapers. I'll speak with Valer, then join your forces. If you'll have me, of course. I'd be honored. The honor is mine, my friend. Everything's taken care of down here. Bring in the shuttle. Right, Commander. I'll just follow the smoke. I read your report, Commander. We had no idea the situation had deteriorated so quickly. That's why I set off the bomb. May the Ardat Yakshi find rest. What the Reapers did to them was monstrous. I had another team of commandos headed to the monastery who I can now formally transfer to Admiral Hackett's command. They'll serve you loyally, Commander. Farewell. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on this call. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. like to speak with you down in the med bay.
Shepard? Remember our agreement? We'd open a bottle of Cerise-Ice brandy every year, and it's my turn to buy. But it hasn't been a year yet. Yes, well, something tells me we won't have the chance a few months from now, so... Indulge my impatience. Doctor, put that bottle in a safe place. We'll crack it open to celebrate our victory over the Reapers. Admire your optimism, and I'll look forward to the day we can share it. Till then. The Asari were the first species to discover the citadel. What is
found something. Signal confirmed.
Signal confirmed. light jump successful. Evasion successful.
We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. I'd call it dangerous as hell. Bryson's assistant tried to kill me. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Bryson's assistant Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. But the miners... They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Anything interesting about the artifact's structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. Edie, what project was Garneau working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then... no. There's got to be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarra paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garneau on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the Nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. card. Any idea what it opens? The requisitions locker. According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Let's 
see what Anne Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Didn't need an environmental suit. Water recycling equipment. Based on what Anne Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Does anything in Anne Bryson's work history suggest where she might be? Nothing relevant. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture. But there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. There are specifications for several ships here. We need to find the Icarus. Which ship am I looking for again? The Icarus. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system. Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay, we can rule out the relay system. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Anne Bryson. Sergeant, I have a little brother. He went off-planet to try and make money, hung with a lousy crowd. A week before the Reapers, my brother sent me this excited message. He'd found an organization with lots of pay, benefits. He snuck the armor they gave him. White and yellow armor.
Thank you again, Commander. I appreciate the assist. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Yes, I'm seeing increased turnout as well. Service attempts to take control of the Citadel have failed. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. I think I know which project you mean, and I've got a Hesperia period statue in Bay D24. Commander Shepard, that's excellent news. I'll have it sent to that project right away. Thank you so much for your help. It's my money, and I'm closing my account. <laughs> your account helps fund Citadel defense. If you shut it down and hide the money under your bed, it hurts the war effort. And if Cerberus attacks again and takes the Citadel, my money is gone. I'll take my chance. Have you seen Palavin? Or Earth? You can't escape this war. At least here, you've got the Council fighting for you. But to fight, they need money. Money this bank has loaned them using accounts like... Welcome to Kanala Exports. Besides, Kanala Exports is pleased to offer goods for security and peace of mind. You're right. Guess all we can do is hope for the best. At Kanala Exports, we believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times Thank of Thank you for crisis. shopping at Kanala Exports. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties.
any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Any Thank opened you. goods can Come only again. be returned for store credit. So did you tell the refugee camp who Gorak really is? I tried. What happened? A joint turning of Krogan force has landed on a river in an attempt to retake the home of the world from Reaper forces. The blue soldiers and the blue pack mercenaries have found another one. I've recovered the obelisk of Karza. It's waiting for you in Bay D-24. You have? It's amazing! Thank you, Commander. That's going to help immeasurably with some very sensitive work. Her name is Tasha Poré. Of course. P-O-R-A-E. No, I realize you can't tell me where she was deployed. Can you inform me if she's under orders not to communicate with her family? It's uh, been a while since I heard from her. Uh-huh. But I would be contacted if she were injured, correct? Yes, I'm listed as her bond mate. Yes, I can hold. Her name is Tasha Poré. Of course. Weshra? I have an honor for you. For me? Where did this come? Oh, no. Oh, Tasha. Thank you for bringing this back. At least I know what happened. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. For the best in the business, come to Casa. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. For the best in the business, come to Casa. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. For the best in the business, come to Casa. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go to the Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. All licensed huntresses may apply for a professional discount. Good hunting. Mm -hmm. 
You sure you don't want to do something a little more exciting? I love this part of the Presidium. It reminds me of where I grew up. Where's that? Armali, back on Thessia. My mother and I lived beside a park. I spent hours there. Doing what? <laughs> Reading, exploring. Getting in trouble digging for ruins in the grass. <laughs> You're kidding. I was very young. Yeah, that's actually pretty cute. No one else thought it was funny. Oh, the lecture my mother gave me. But she did buy me my first history book the next day. I miss her, Shepard. What was she like? She was confident and kind. She loved to wear yellow. I thought she was the most beautiful woman in the world. You'll be okay, Liara. Maybe you're right. Thank you, Shepard. I feel better. I wish we could spend more time together like this. Just friends. I think we'd be good together, Liara. I... Shepard, I didn't think... Uh, not that I... I mean... I could see how... Sorry. No pressure. No, no. I can tell you my answer now. I like you a lot too, Shepard. And I... like it very much. I would too. Shepard. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Agor Munitions, for deals you never see coming. obey all local government restrictions when purchasing protective equipment. Our customer service specialists are always interested in purchasing new technology. Thank you for shopping at Agor. Welcome to Superteen Armory. Citratine Armory products include a lifetime guarantee for performance. See our extranet site for details. Proceeds from all sales go to help the troops on Palavan. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's Cipratine. Thank Munitions. you for shopping at Cipratine Armory. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Please obey all local government restrictions when purchasing protective equipment. Remember, all purchases made by Agor Munitions will show in your credit report as AM Trading Limited. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the athlete the Found another one. Yeah, the guys in some carriages, too. They say it's human colonies, Elysium. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now a 
arriving at Presidium Embassy. Thank you again, Earth Clan. Our military strength is minimal, but we are proud to help as we can. I hoped you'd come. I won't remain here much longer. What are you doing on the Citadel, Samara? I suppose I came to say goodbye. Faler is safe, and Rila is at rest. I felt the need to speak to you before heading to battle. I want you to know there is no one else I'd rather see leading us in our last hours. We'll make the galaxy proud. The largest fleet in history is already on our side. It is impressive. Most would have deemed such an alliance impossible. But Shepard, be sure to assess your force's strengths and weaknesses before setting out. What are the other Justicars doing for the war? Most have made it home. They will attempt to hold Thessia. With the odds we face, it's possible our order will no longer exist after this war. There's that few of you? Our numbers were never great. We must prepare to sacrifice ourselves, if that is what's required. Was being a Justicar worth it, if that's how it all ends? The Justicars were formed to bring order to a world that laughs at the notion. The role is solitary. Its demands are lonely and uncompromising, often to the point of pain. But... Following the code left me with no regrets. Take that for what you will. You know, I never asked you if your code has anything useful on fighting Reapers. Treat them as any other enemy. Show no quarter, mercy, or weakness. The only difference is the scale of our foe. The code is too strict to account for such... small discrepancies. Is that how you see it too? You yourself killed a Reaper on the Citadel, and then another on Tachanka. I can only follow such bravery. Will Falaire be alright in the Monastery? Or what's left of it? We spoke for some time. It won't be easy. But if there is a way to survive, Falaire will find it. It was... good to see her again. Perhaps it's unseemly for a Justicar to dwell so much on her family. I'm just happy things worked out. I was fortunate that Falaire saw things so clearly. And it would have turned out quite differently without your intervention. Thank you. Good luck out there, Samara. You as well. I don't know if you believe in such things. But Goddess, go with you, Shepard. We'll both be tested in fire, soon enough. The Grissom Academy also fell to the Reapers when Elysium was attacked. An alliance of forces were able to evacuate the Reapers. Good to see you're all right, Shepard. 
Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Udina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard's still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I heard a rumor, maybe more, that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man? Especially now. My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history. Ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. We have to figure this out. I agree, but... I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? No. I couldn't.
Your intel, right? I found these encryption codes on a Cerberus engineer. I thought they might be helpful. Cerberus ciphers? That's exactly what we've been looking for. Thank you, Commander. Yes. Commander Shepard found some encryption algorithms. The team thinks so. Uh, so many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. All that time you were working for Udina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead and you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Udina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. Was the Volus ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. Let me know when you want to see the office. Until we killed Korlak. 
once the credits go through. Was beginning to think you weren't interested in the money. I'm not. Because Korlak worked for Cerberus? What'd they do to you? None of your goddamn business. He waking up. This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Tell me where you are. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. C-Sec will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Wait. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that... Stay calm. Help's coming. Now arriving at Presidium... Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why he's here. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? Now you know my name, all of a sudden. Good question. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go toward the Turian war effort. Oh, that's a lovely idea. I really appreciate management doing it. My husband's away on duty right now. Oh, you're bonded with Turian? No, actually, my husband's a Krogan. Oh, well, that's great. I just hope he knows which ones to fight. Excuse me? Oh, I didn't... Uh, well, I, I just... My husband is risking his life to protect us right now. I'm so sorry. That was thoughtless and... Uh, I'm so sorry. No, no, I understand. Sometimes I'm surprised myself. Anyway, would you like to make a purchase? Yes, yes, of course. Excuse me. I'm sorry. You need to hear this. Oh, Blue Rose of Helium. If these humble words reach you, then I have joined my ancestors. No, no, no. My dream was to be by your side, a weed beside your beauty, twining together in the warm Tachanka sun. Oh, Char. But if my last days must be with Krant instead of kindness, still I will remember the perfume of your scent and the soft touch of your petals. Let my broken bones build a wall around your garden, so you and the flower we planted together can grow safe and strong. Thank you. I should... I need to go. Welcome to Nosostra Sporting Goods. Good hunting. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the acid cut him. Killed him when Ranger went back. Stacked up. His former deterrence proves that the Krogan are ready to return to the Citadel. Wrong door. We need you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. Drop my name. Shepard's investigating. She's a reason to quit.
been a while, Zaid. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? I'm here, Commander. I... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. Did those marks hurt you? I'm fine. They wanted me alive until the fees were delivered for my capture. They didn't care about what I had to say. You kept mentioning a colony in your message. Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. Turn? You already betrayed your own people. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a colony. Or you could give us both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. You tried to do the right thing before. It failed because you trusted the wrong people. Now here's your chance to make up for it. You're giving us Volus support, and you're going to help us make Cerberus pay for using you. I can't. You can. Waste of everyone's time trying to appeal to a Volus's better nature, Shepard. Aphis. The colony's name is Aphis. Cerberus wants its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Yes, it's yours, Commander. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this... incident. You have my thanks. Took him long enough to spit that out. Zaid, what are you doing here? Later, C6 on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. Catch up with me at the docks if you like. If I was his doctor, I'd pull the plug. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay E-24. Emergency civilian housing.
Pressure's okay. No infection so far. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Are you Gorek? Go away. Nothing to say. Not even what a terrorist's doing on the Citadel? You! Do I know you? <laughs> Every Batarian with someone on Aratok remembers your face. Planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butcher a colony. Only regret. <laughs> Don't have the strength to. I destroyed Eratot's relay to stop the Reapers from pouring through. <laughs> Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. You think I didn't feel guilty? I destroyed a colony. I've thought about the people who died, about how I couldn't warn them in time. In the end, I didn't have a choice. But I'm sorry, if that means anything. If you're so remorseful, if you have any real guilt, show some mercy. Unplug this machine. Let me join my family. Wondered if you'd show up, Sherpin. Figured you'd be too busy recruiting goddamn armies for this war you're in charge of. Who are those people you were with? Bunch of mercs from Omega. Signed on with them when I heard they were making a hit on Cerberus. Should have studied the job longer. There's no way you could have known Korlak stopped working for Cerberus. That's no excuse. I killed Korlak and I'd have done right by Cerberus. No. The way I see it, those bastards owe me. Do you know the current leader of the Suns? Vosk, don't remind me. Little scumbag shot his mouth off on a patrol mission once. Got half his squad killed. Real popular after that. We couldn't boot him from the Suns fast enough. Should have ended his tenure with a bullet. Then what's Vosk doing as Blue Sun's leader? He's vicious, organized, and a suck-up. Vito must have welcomed him back once I was gone. Voss thinks he's got a bargaining position with Arya. What a laugh. I'll give it a month before she knocks his teeth in. No designs on the Blue Suns yourself? I spent some of the best years of my life putting the Suns together. Nowadays, they're just another gang posing as mercenaries. Breaks my goddamn heart to see what Vito turned them into. So you're not interested? Nah. I was done with them a long time ago. You seem pretty calm about the Reapers showing up. Just wish they'd waited until I was dead and buried before setting Earth on fire. At my age, you're supposed to take it easy. But that fleet you're putting together might make the Reapers think twice if you pull it off. If? Nothing personal. There's just a hell of a lot that could still go wrong. Not gonna have much luck just sitting around. True, but you've picked a hell of a fight to get yourself into. Free space is shrinking every day, and everyone knows it. Should get your fleets moving, at least. Keep them focused. I'll keep it in mind. I could always use more help. I'll bet. I've seen footage of what happened on Earth. Tell you what. I'll see if some old contacts of mine are still around. 
Can't promise you anything, but if enough of them are still breathing, I can lend a hand. What else were you up to before the war? I had Vito to hunt down after he got away from his son Zoya. Cost me nearly everything I'd made to track him down, but I did it. Found him on a son's base inside a colony. Hired some men, stormed the place. Blew up the shuttle port first this time. So what happened to Vito? Vito was holed up in a tower with nowhere to go. I was close. We could hear Vito panicking, screaming orders. Then this shadow fell over everything. Damnedest thing, hearing a battlefield go quiet like that. Bet you can guess what happened. The Reapers. Yeah. Completely tore up the base. Bunch of harvesters scooped up everyone in sight. Saw one grab Vito. Can still hear the bastard scream. He tried shooting, but the gun fell out of his hand. Then he looked straight at me. Finally saw me. Begged me to shoot him. What'd you do? I walked away. Dodged the rest of the fight. Only one who made it back to the shuttle. Still, felt like I won that one. See you around, Zaid. All right, Shepard. I'll be here a while. Thank you, human. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Batarian State Arms. Defending the hegemony. I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with our... Son of a bitch. I found a Prothean Sphere on Gay Hinnom. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. About time? Yes, thank you. I'll call them right now. Thank you, Commander. I've gotten food for my family. And for some of the others... About time? I know, I know. You don't have to say anything. But I'm about to make my comeback. Mm-hmm. I believe those are my credits. You thought I was bluffing, didn't you? Hey there. Oh, it's you, hey. Spectre status, recognize. One moment, please. Now arriving at ward level, purgatory. Will you need heavy armor? We are here to help you.
texts from a library in Reaper-controlled space. I can have them waiting for you at Bay D-24 if that would help. Really? Oh, damn. Couldn't hurt. Thank you. Unread messages at your private terminal, Commander. Trainer, if you're not doing anything, I've got a few hours free. Would you like to come up? Your cabin is gorgeous. I've seen apartments smaller than this. Oh! An actual shower. The faucets in the women's bathroom are crap, by the way. Well, Commander, ready to play? Play? I picked up a chessboard on the Citadel. Gooey interface, not nearly as nice as real pieces, but this takes up less space. And I recall you delivered something that closely resembled a challenge. So, interested? This is a trap, isn't it? I'm just a simple lab scientist, Commander. I'm sure your real-world expertise will give you an edge. Ha! 
Oh, come on. <laughs> My word, Commander. It's almost as though you wanted to spare your pawns the indignity of living under my regime. In real life, that tactic would have worked. Well, in real life, one doesn't move on an 8x8 eight eight square grid. You know what I mean. The pawns are infantry. A good infantry line like the Krogan can take a charge like that. That reminds me of a joke. What's the difference between Commander Shepard and a Krogan? One is an unstoppable juggernaut of head-butting destruction. And the other doesn't have a smart-ass comm officer to keep her in line. Ooh, that's even better than the number of testicles punchline. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't run back to the lab, trainer. Thanks. So, rematch? Hell yes. <laughs>